hello, welcome to Roll Review. My name is Alec Mars, and today we are going to review my shots with the film stock Kodak Ultramax 400 speed. So, let's jump into it. This one was a, uh, a misfire, I'm going to assume, because I cannot distinguish or remember uh, what this is. It looks like it was indoors. Um, could be of my partner. Hard to say. Anyways, not gonna really go too in-depth into it. But, yeah. Misfire. Alright, I really love this one. I love the colors, the contrast, the blue, the green with the mountain ranges. I like these fence posts that we've got here. Or telephone lines. I don't know what they are. Something... If you know what they are, let me know in the doobly-doo. But, um, yeah, I shot this from the car. Um, probably uh, at least 1 25th of a second. Um, yeah, at 50 mil. But I, I, I just, I love this image. So, image rating, out of 5. Um, I'm going to give this... I, I, <laughs> I want to say five, but um, it it can be improved. So I'm gonna say a four, four to five is interesting to me. It is. Um, why is it interesting? Ah, the mountains really, honestly, bring it together for me. And the thing, the things. What is that? Orchards. Look at that strip of orchard all around it with whatever these may be if i i don't know what they are but it was a story that needed to be told so i find it interesting um is it a moment or is it unique um i mean not, not particularly but it's got its own characters it's strong composition um i guess you can say the composition would be negative space like all of this negative space right here and here and then the positive space right here I don't know I don't think I don't think there's anything particularly strong or point you know standing out for this image but um it's got its own aesthetic I don't think it's funny um would I share this absolutely absolutely I think this is a great picture um great scene yeah does need some more in it though um emotional score though absolutely five out of five so yeah next picture um this image uh i'm gonna rate it after uh i go through so is it interesting no not at all there's nothing really interesting except for what are these people doing what's happening right here and why do we see the dash so um no it's not particularly interesting but um i feel like there is a moment here and that moment was arriving to this area um i wish i had a longer focal length at this moment because i did want to kind of highlight the people but felt like I should do the scene more because of the focal length so I did try to make a composition here by putting them in the thirds and this negative space I've been doing a lot I, I've noticed with this film but um is it funny no I don't think it's funny would I share it um, no, I don't think I would. I don't think I'd share this because it doesn't necessarily capture anything unique or um, a, m a moment that can be shared with other people. Um, you would have to have been there uh, to to see or ex have a, an emotional score for it. So, um, this image I'm going to give a 3 out of 5 because for me, it's a moment. Um, but emotionally, I'd give this a 4 out of 5. But for 
shareable reasons and like overall composition like three i think i think it's a decent image it's not anything crazy but definitely has room for improvement so three three out of five but emotionally four out of five misfire um looks like i carry my camera around with me everywhere so this could be when i was moving um moving some items with my camera strapped to my side uh <laughs> Hard to say, but it was a misfire. All right, this is my partner, um, and this is at our new home. So we decided to celebrate by going for a little photo walk, and this was the first photo that I took of them at this place. So image rating. Um, <laughs> emotionally, I think that this is a, a five out of five, but. Um, Let's see, let's go down the list. Is it interesting? Mm, I mean, it's a person, so you've got a subject. There's, is there a moment or is it anything unique? Um, I think I personally feel like that this the light with the color of their shirt looks really nice and kind of has its own aesthetic. Um, I really like just the hard, shadows that it's that is happening right here uh but not anything in particular i could have like you've got a weird story happening with this coming down into the frame so i should have i should have centered it a little bit more maybe even scoot in uh, to focus more on um you know my partner as a whole but uh instead this came out and you know it's got its own story so i i i'm gonna say it doesn't have anything crazy but this this duality that i've been doing in my photos i've, I've noticed um like with right here with the light and shadow uh i'm definitely looking for my color pictures because it's color is so much different from black and white and i've i'm normally sh i've when i started digitally i really did black and white because that is what i thought would help me improve my photos and my overall photography skill in general so i've been working with color and trying to uh trying to figure out color so this is me so this is the you are witnessing my journey so yeah overall i think that um there's nothing particularly interesting besides my partner um i don't think there's any particular moment that we've captured but i think that there is strong composition because it does tell a story there is a story here um and it is aesthetically pleasing uh I would share this, absolutely. So uh, I'm going to give this a uh, 4 out of 5. 4.5 out of 5. And uh, an emotional score of 5 out of 5. Absolutely. Alright, next photo. This one was taken on the highway. Um, yeah, I really like this one. This is, uh, I think, is an interesting image. We've got something in the clouds from the reflection of the window um this line with the buildings and then the fast moving pace of this car definitely a moment i think it's unique because of the moment is it interesting at first glance no but the more you look at it i feel like there's there's more to appreciate and gather i mean the light and shadow on the building <laughs> again whatever that is and then the reflection with the motion of this car is just yeah i love it um so i think there uh, the negative space with the buildings as subjects i think is a very good strong composition um and it has its own aesthetic with the overall um, 
the negative space with the subject is very pinpoint, if that makes sense. It's all in this area, this, this area. So would I share this? Absolutely. Image rating, I give it a four, nah, just kidding. 3.5 out of five. Could use improvement, could have, I mean, this is for moving vehicles, so <laughs> do with that what you will, but I feel like this was a good shot. So emotionally, I mean, don't really have too much emotion attached to it, but um, it is a lovely image in my opinion, so four to five. Um, but overall image rating, I'd say 3.5 out of five. All right, found this duck, went to a little park with some friends and uh, yeah, this, I, I've seen one other, not, <laughs> not just one other, I've seen a duck uh, similar to this um, and I'm not exactly sure what happens that this, that gives this appearance but uh, it's it's interesting in my opinion. So, um, is this image interesting? Yeah, I mean, look, you've got people over here with the dog, you've got a person sitting, vehicles, whatever that color is, blue, good lord, um, and ducks. Come on, it's a whole scene. We've got a scene right here, a good little triangle. And is there a moment? I mean, I think there is a moment. I think that's up for the viewer's choice to decide. Uh, I think this is a bit uh, more on the objective side or subjective for is this unique or is this a moment? I was simply just trying to capture the duck and happened to capture all of this. So, um... I don't think there's anything particularly popped out that's that calls to my aesthetic bones, but um, yeah, is it funny? I think it is. I think that duck looks hilarious. Um, so yeah, I would share this. Overall, this image I'm gonna give uh, a four <laughs> out of five because I think it's great. I think it's a great image. Um, so I would share it. Uh, emotionally though uh, about two out of five N nothing really too charged about it all right this image um, is at the same park um, shot this I believe I've been working on, sh on shooting with uh, more uh, what's the word um, larger apertures so um i can use longer shutter speeds which is fun but uh i think yeah i'm not i think this is probably at 5.6 for the aperture anyways interesting is it interesting i mean you get some geese you got sparkly water and some trees it's not anything crazy but to someone who's never seen any of these, I would say it's pretty interesting. Is there a moment? Is it unique? It's not unique, but it I believe there is a moment. It's you've got three three geese and a duck. Oh, I just love the grain on this. I mean come on, look at this. It looks fantastic. This I like I'm really happy with how this came out I these stars I think are from actually not f so this must have been shot at <laughs> I wrote this down somewhere and I lost my notebook so forgive me as I'm guessing what my settings were but I'm pretty sure to get these you got to be shooting at least 16 at least um, an aperture of 16 so we know that I'm pretty sure that is accurate because oh come on it looks amazing with the geese I love birds birds are hold the dear place in my heart 
Um, so, <laughs> yeah, this is great. Composition. Uh, I could have waited a little bit for the ducks to move. To, for the duck to move. Um, and, like, kind of do, like, parallel to the geese. But this is what I captured. So, uh, composition could be improved. But overall, I think it's decent. Um, is there aesthetic? Absolutely. I mean, come on, look at the sparkly water. That's got to be something for someone. Is it funny? No, I don't think it's a funny picture. But mm, who am I to say it's not? So overall, I'd give this image a uh, 4 out of 5. Um, is it shareable? Absolutely. Um, emotionally, the more I look at this picture, the more I love it. So I'm going to say... Four out of five, absolutely. All right, next shot. Another duck. Yeah, this is this is not interesting unless you've never seen this colored colored duck. Yeah, so um, I could have I tried to get as close as possible to this to this uh, creature, but um, it this is with fifty mil, so kind of got to get pretty close uh, is it unique no no particular you moment that's happening to make it unique um, composition no I could have put it on a third I could have um, gotten lower I could have I need to improve this composition uh, my composition and slow down a little bit more um, is it shareable I mean, maybe after some editing, I'd share it. Maybe zoom in on the duck, look at its features, something like that, maybe. But, uh, I mean, it's nothing to write home about. Ma, look at this duck I took a picture of. Nah. All right, next picture. Oh, uh, image, I give it a 2 out of 5 because it's a duck. And nothing in particularly interesting about it. I thought it would come out differently. I'm also just testing this film, so two out of five. Uh, another picture of my partner. Uh, this is at the park. Um, my partner was feeling a little overwhelmed, so uh, I want. I try to capture those around me in a respectful manner and this captures that moment well how they were feeling and in a way how it was affecting not necessarily how it was affecting me but how it was a um, maybe it is affecting me affecting how I took the picture I guess I should say so um, yeah, I mean, is it interesting? No, not really. Not really interesting. Is there a moment? Absolutely. There is, um, there's a moment, but have I captured it in a way that people like you guys, you folks, can also see the moment? I think I did. Um, the composition, again, could be improved but I think overall it looks pretty good um, is there anything aesthetic about this image mm, no no not really um, no I mean it looks great though I mean captured the lights well the shadows kind of blur in a little over there but that's all right Overall, I think this is a decent image. So, um, because there is a moment, there is that high emotional score for me. So this is a a five out of five for me because of the moment I've captured that I know about. Um, we need to improve on being able to translate that. So it shared in the image so I'm gonna give this a four out of five um, this
this is an image of an oven and uh, the moment in this is my partner was creating their first Dutch baby and I also had my first Dutch baby that day um, which is a egg pastry kind of thing it's delicious it's like a frittata I think but a pastry it's just look it up try it have one your mind will be blown or not I don't know do what you want but yeah um <laughs> this image is a one out of five because <laughs> I did not capture this moment well so would I share this no is there aesthetic eh composition needs improvement moment I remember the moment but I did not capture the moment in a way that you who are looking at this can appreciate it so uh, one out of five another image of my partner um, this is another day and we are going somewhere and they just looked good, so I thought I'd take a picture of them with the lights and their sunglasses. So, is it interesting? No, it's just a snap. Not, a, it's not just a snap, but it's it's a photo that is emotional. So, an emotional photo. Uh, is it there a moment? Is it unique? No, it's not particularly unique, but there's a moment. Um, in, great great image I think overall this looks fantastic I like the colors the warmness of Kodak brings to everything uh, the skin looks great so yeah I mean overall I'm, I'm pretty happy with this picture uh, it's a four out of five for me it's not necessarily aesthetic uh, I would share this this is a good image for you know needs a little editing but overall it's pretty good so emotional score five out of five image rating i'd give it a four out of five needs improvement on composition but other than that it's a pretty strong image i feel like oh yes a classic um i really love this picture um so what i was doing what i was trying to go for was a triangle i was trying to build a viewpoint for your eyes to just kind of wander um let me know in the comments if i did that successfully uh but yeah i was looking at the mirror the rear view mirror or the side mirror and um my partner is driving so i wanted to also capture them while seeing if anything in the background so background still mid ground get that get over here this and then my partner being the foreground so having this area I think looks real nice um, and then just being able to have the sharpness of this let's check it out like that, that's pretty good in my opinion like I didn't know film is amazing this is this is uh, amazing stuff so is it interesting i think it is i think um with the dynamic that i was going for um makes it interesting is there a moment and is it unique uh, i think there is a moment i think the moment can be deciphered in many ways but for me um it captures a point in traveling so is this a strong composition i think this is the strongest comp tr strongest composition um of my images so far so uh yeah i do i think this is real good really good <laughs> uh forgive me my countryness comes out every now and then would i share this absolutely i've shared it already <laughs> check out my instagram and the doobly doob um so emotional score five out of five image rating 
five out of five. Just, I think this is just fantastic, a fantastic image. All right, next photo. This is the Sacramento River. Um, and you can see, I saw, so again, this is a moment where I wish I had a longer focal length, um, but make do with what you got. Um, I saw this bird with the water and the mountains behind. I pushed the shutter, I pushed the button one second too late because those mountains were a little centered more to the right over here and it ugh, come on but oh, that's not what I captured so it tells a different story now um, isn't it interesting mm, it's nature so it depends on if you like nature I like nature I think it, I don't think it, there's anything in particularly interesting but um I think there's a moment here especially with um, <laughs> the railing here, it, mm, that foreground gives some sort of story about this beautiful area is restricted or, um, restricted access essentially. And you've got this bird and the dot hardly a cloud in the sky so the negative space the river kind of is a leading lion away the mountains i wish were a little to the right so i mean overall i think this is a pretty good composed image um it's got its own aesthetic the blues and the browns slight greenish um but just warm tint i, I think it looks great it's got its own moment so uh three out of five emotional score two out of five not really too attached to it all right this image is uh i'm already gonna rate it uh so at this time at the time of taking this photo sacramento was flooding and flooding and um, lots of major areas and I tr this over here is a out uh, restroom area that was completely submerged um, again I'm capturing this while on the highway going probably 70 miles 75 miles an hour so uh, take what take with that would what you will so emotionally I'm not too attached to it I tried um, looking at it, it doesn't spark anything so I mean overall this image is a 1 out of 5 and emotionally I'd give it a 1 out of 5 this is a another picture of my partner and um, I'm just getting my rubric uh, image is it interesting? not particularly it's just a nice quiet moment so I think there's a moment here. Um, I think that we've got the rule of thirds going on for the composition. So very simple, but I think it works. Um, it's got its own aesthetic, the silhouette of my partner. And um, I <laughs> pulling strings, but for me, that's the silhouette the sun just kind of seeping through, touching the, the plants. And I think, yeah, it's overall a decent image. Um, I like it more for the emotional score than the actual image, excuse me, composition, but it's a, it's a moment. So uh, I give this a 3.5 out of five and emotional score five out of five. Overall, could use a little I could have framed it a bit better uh, but this is what happened could have been a misfire another image that's too dark um, so uh, I'm gonna give this a 1 out of 5 but emotionally it's it's like a 3 out of 5 because it's another moment but um 
not a shareable moment. <laughs> All right, I love this image, but this is where I'm gonna pause. So thank you for watching my video. Um, let me know what you think about this version with me showing my lovely face. Um, and yeah, if you want me to review a certain film stock, let me know uh, in the doobly doo. And uh, I will catch you guys next time for Bowl Review. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a wonderful day.